Hey guys, it's Ben out in the last part. We did. We lagged with traps. Yes, we did that too. Um, we're up to Arabian Heights, which is the fifth special stage. I haven't actually seen it. Oh, they barely used the lightning, didn't they? Oh, I guess I gotta run back for the platform. Fraps! I thought we talked about this. Alright. I think you're good, Fraps. See, I'm okay with dark sections like this, where you know at least where you're going for the most part. Oh, goodness. I shouldn't have jumped like that. I shouldn't jump like that. I like this lightning they're going with. For fun, yeah. There's life. I'll take that. If you had a choice between crystals and and uh, life, go for the crystals. If you don't have any, other th otherwise just go for the life because the life is worth a hundred crystals. Unless if you don't have crystals, in that case, you probably prefer crystals. Lots of enemies. Oh no! Actually, to be quite honest, this stage hasn't actually incredibly peeved me. But that is awesome! Whoa, gosh! <laughs> oh goodness, I knew they'd throw one of those at me. Ah. That's soup. That's kind of tricky. Put the enemy in the middle of the rotating platforms. Oh goodness. I mean I can't run past them. That's the problem. Okay, whoa oh, gosh. Oh my god. This way. Keep getting those crystals. I'm gonna need them to get hit by that guy. I'm gonna I was gonna die another way, but okay. I like how everything respawns. Very nice of them to. Oh my goodness! Same, same guy. I bet you there's gonna be another guy in the exact same way, just over here. I'm okay. gonna. Wow! What a big guess. Thank goodness there's crystals over here. But if they pull the exact same thing on me again. Oh come on! It's a special stage. I'm not supposed to be dying. Ah. Uh. The placement, it's just so annoying. Oh gosh. I can't dodge him. I'm okay with that if you since they give you crystals, but Look! I I I, I just realized that. What? Why'd I stop? Ah, oh, for goodness sake. Okay, that's three times I've died on this. Wow! Wow, you... This is world three and I'm just now suddenly sucking as bad as a fourth grader. And we don't say grader that much. That's why I'm saying grader, just so you Americans know exactly what I mean. Because we say year. We say year four rather than fourth grade. Where we also drive upside down. We also ride in kangaroos. Seriously. Oh, it's still going! Come on! I thought the puzzle piece would be there. Oh, I'm okay with there. I'm okay with right there, seriously. Dude, I lost my... I lost lives. I lost my love. Alright. So... That, was, that wasn't so bad. So the Fito Burrito! He has a code! Oh goodness. The Fito Burrito. Okay. Oh yeah, I remember testing out this stage. It annoyed me. Cause look at that, two enemies right at the top. It's two lives, yes! So here's what I do. Go for this. Get that. Dodge. 
dodge, get hit, and then just climb up. Because <laughs> then two lives, easy done. And then you gotta jump on. Oh. Ah, no, nah, there you go. All okay, right, then you just gotta climb this tower. I remember trying out this stage. Okay. I'm gonna do the most annoying section. Oh, for goodness sake. The music! Man, got the music. <laughs> that one's actually. You'd <laughs> be. I, I am currently going. Wow, that's. Oh gosh! Moving platforms. <gasps> Kazoom! Ah, oh, gosh. So yeah, just crystals. And then you jump in the middle, and you're just like, yeah, more crystals. What do you expect? What else could they give you? Or oh, a puzzle piece, I guess. But... You're going, ah, oh, the puzzle piece is right there. Well, you gotta go underwater first. We haven't done that in a while. We haven't gone underwater since World 3, pretty much. And considering we're back at World 3, so you need to go down, get that key, get the frick back up. I don't care. I do whatever I want. <laughs> oh gosh. You swim back in, and then you hop out, slide out, hit that button, and hopefully a platform will come down and rescue you from your days. But don't fall in. Believe me, that can happen. Falling back in. Boing. Yeah, I got a few lives out of that. Oh, I expected it to be actually a lot worse. You may be going, are you kidding me? You just, like, went through all that. No sweat. Yes. <laughs> Seriously, there was, like, no sweat on me brow. On me brow! <laughs> okay. So, yeah. You know, we're up to the last two special stages, and then we've got the last world, which is only half a world, but it's considerable. Oh, this annoyed me so much. Now, this is the only time in the game where you will ever need to kill enemies in order to proceed. How to kill these guys? That. That is the only way you can kill them. So, you need to master the skill of being able to, to jump off destroyed platforms. And you also need to make sure you don't die because the enemies respawn when you die and they, they don't put any crystals in this stage. Or at least not yet. sound they make is kind of cool. It's like, yeah! I can't do it. Watch out! So yeah, and don't try destroying all the boxes. Because seriously, there's no platform underneath them. Anyway, we're going to where... what? kill them all, then the key just magically pops in there. So yeah. It's a good idea, you know. Make a stage where you actually have to kill all the enemies. Whoa. What a clever way to kill all the enemies and to destroy boxes. Ah, oh, nah, nah. The thing is, I'm trying to be kind of crafty with this. Oh, gosh. Because I'm trying.
trying to walk back onto it. It's a bit, it's a bit tough trying to go back onto it. Okay. There you go. I'm gonna jump over you. I'm gonna try and do this while facing forward. See, it's a lot easier facing forward because you got, because you got a lot more forward momentum. Okay, how are we gonna get this guy? We'll just do it the same way we did all the rest. Wait for the key. Key. <laughs> okay. So what are they gonna do now? Exactly the same thing. And wow, that was that was so good. Now I'm gonna try and do it again. <laughs> Alright. How many lives? Ten. Ten lives is good. Oh, weird, I haven't got a game over in a while. Cough, cough, cough. See, yeah, again, no crystals, so don't try and do this one if you're gonna try and... If you're gonna wanna get, um... Get crystals for lives, which is actually a really unethical... Unethical? It's, it's not really economically stable, so to speak. It's not worth the time and effort trying to pick up all these crystals because you're gonna they're very easily lost and for the most part it's just easier to find the lives in the stages it's nice that they accumulate and all that stuff but for the most part you, you know you know I don't go around trying to collect them in fact in the second game in the second game I'll try to I'll try to pick them all up there, there will be limitations I won't be able to pick them all up because just because of difficulty's sake, and also trying to protect my lives. Key. So you may be wondering, when is the end of this stage? Well, that's a good question. Oh, there it is. Morning. So, what do you have to kill these guys for? Well, I guess they might just want to clap them up at the very end. Yeah, so that guy's dead. Keep going on. Keep going until dawn. Not well, I guess I might need to sleep. Copyright! Oh, is that platform always there? What's the point of killing these guys then? I don't know, I'll see. Maybe I'll spew tons of crystals at you. Absolutely freaking nothing. So yeah, this stage is probably the most pointless of them all, because you can't get anything out of it. Besides that puzzle piece. Alright, and last one, Jailhouse Croc. I have played this one. It is very difficult. Yes. You know one thing confusing about the PlayStation? You see those arrow keys? Like the pictures of the arrow keys? If you see the arrow key by itself, you think you're facing the other way. Like, look at the PlayStation control and just kind of isolate one of the arrow keys. One of the directional keys. You can't tell that it's going one way. Alright, so this stage... It's base. It's actually... Yeah, it's rather easy. Literally, it's just kind of follow the path, and just dodge fireballs, and that's about it. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. The later stages will get kind of difficult. Oh, and then there's this. You know, it's rather easy, you know? It's just a bit of jumping. By this stage, if you're up to, to 4S2, then I'm assuming you really, you know your controls by now. You get quite a lot of crystals out of this stage, to be honest, but... Again, it's crystals, not... Like, anything special. 
you know, it's not lives. In fact, by this stage, lives not really worth too much. Oh uh, yeah, there's a lot of crystals in this stage. But yeah, you saw how easy the stage was. And then I tell you, that was it. That was it. So I guess in the next part, I'll just say that's the finale. The whole last world is a good finale to this whole LP. Now, that's, that being said, we've gotten all the puzzle pieces. So you know what we're going to do? They're all the same shape as well. Oh. No, they're not. So, apparently now, solving the puzzle makes the island just magically appear. You may be wondering, what the heck? Why is Fraps lagging? Oh, come on, Fraps. Come on, Fraps. You made it through almost one part, come on. Fraps. Oh. Jeez, Fraps. What? What? Lag. No, I honestly have never seen this cutscene, so I'm just going like, what? Well, I, d I know of it. Hold on, I'm just going to do a quick Fraps reset. Okay. Quick fresh reset. Okay, so I'll see you guys next part because I really gotta sort out this lag. Woo!